Listen, I said Papoose, great rapper, intelligent dude, always holding his woman up in the air. You cannot be a good man if your bitch ain't shit. Uh -huh. let, me, let, me, let me say it in language terms. <clears throat> you are not a good man if you don't have a good woman. We got action. We got action. Corey Holcomb speaks. Papoose. Remy Ma. Cold Heart Advice. I did what Corey Holcomb just said is some it's some real shit. Some it's, it's it's really deep if you really think about it. First off, you are what you attract. I mean, I know some people be trying to deny that or say, okay, I'm just trying something different. I mean, like it's different ways you can really look at what he said, but but the core meaning of what he's getting at is. Not only you are what you attract, but even if you spend time with somebody who ain't shit, it's a reflection of you. And people around you are going to see that. Not saying that we have to live for other people or the judgment of others, but it's kind of like if, 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 if you're an alcoholic and you think of you about to work and make it work with somebody who don't drink at all, it's not going to happen. You are living in two opposite worlds. It's going to be a tug of war of, or an identity crisis of who's who and what's what and who's being themselves. So if a person or if your woman ain't shit or the male, like I said, I'm going to make this no male, female thing, but in all actuality, it comes down to that. If I know my woman ain't shit and I'm still just sticking around and I'm trying to make it work and trying to make her a different person and really just dealing with it. I mean, sooner or later, who's going to give in? Who's going to structure their whole reality? Who's I mean, who's going to restructure their whole character to who? And that's what's wrong with a lot of people out here. It, it's, it's the battle that people are attracted to. They're attracted to the, okay, let me see if I can change this person. It's no different than when a female is dealing with a man that's cheating on her. If you're dealing with that over and over, and if you steady putting it in your head that, okay, I'm going to deal with him cheating. This is what men do. Where's the end game? So just think about what Corey said. I'm gonna keep it, keep it short and sweet, and just and and, and leave it just at that. Get with y'all in a minute. We got action. Corey Holcomb gives cold heart advice to Remy Ma and Pat Poops. Wake definitely gave advice to Pat Poops. Not sure if he take heed or not. Can't save them all. And what's so cold, cold, what's so cold about this game is when you when you do love hard and give them that attention. They look for the they look for the person that's not giving it to them. They look for the person that's giving them the challenge. You get too comfortable in the love. We live in a world where things are fast paced and people want something to work for. That's what women want. Women want to work for the relationship. It goes back to that core inside a woman being a nurturer, being the one that's supposed to put things together or keep things together. It's either one of the two. It's putting things together or keeping it together. Keeping these women on their toes. I mean, it ain't no mind game. It ain't no pimp shit. That's just the way of life. We are outnumbered. Men are outnumbered. Shit, damn, they ain't the one now. There's women everywhere. And not to mention the real the real men who ain't gay or going upside their head or in jail and all that. I mean, not the gay bash or nothing, but just imagine how the odds is for, for a straight man like me. Just imagine my odds. 
of women, of women who like real men. Who, I'm talking about men who are not gay or not crazy or not incarcerated. Imagine those numbers and odds for the straight men out here. <laughs> Imagine those odds and numbers. I'll get with y'all in a minute. We got action. It's still a lot to sort through, though. Get with y'all in a minute. Rap talk.